Hey Admirals fans, Jamie Evers here with Voice of the Admirals, Aaron Sims. The Admirals play the San Antonio Rampage for the third time this season tonight, but the first time in Milwaukee. They're coming off a 5-3 win against the Rockford Icehawks last night where Justin Kirkland had a hat trick. Yeah, it's interesting because Kirkland had, has played pretty much every game, if not every game. Uh, did not score until game 40. Last night was game 47, and so he has 2-3-4 and four last night. Uh, he was fantastic. It's been a great year for Justin Kirkland with regard to learning. Um, last night he's, on a, he's playing right wing. He's played center. He's played left wing. He's been out on the penalty kill. He's been in the checking role. He's been on the power play. Uh, he's getting a, a lot thrown at him. And uh, he is playing sufficiently and efficiently at all of these spots. And it's been, uh, it's been a neat thing to watch. We always talk about the growth from your rookie year or from uh, your, your amateur year to your first year as a pro. But that leap from one, year one to year two is pretty big. And Kirkland, uh, I think, has handled it well, even though the success offensively hasn't been there. So it's nice to see him get the hat trick. Uh, Jimmy Olaney scored a beautiful goal. Uh, he said it's probably the prettiest goal he's ever scored in his life. And Freddie Gaudreau scored on the power. Power play showing the importance of winning faceoffs. Uh, the first period and the third period for Admirals were outstanding. Second period, the Admirals were not very good. They did not get the pucks deep. They got hemmed into their defensive zone quite a bit, and that's where Anders Lindbeck uh, played hero again. Uh, he's bailed out the Admirals many times this season, as we've seen. Uh, he was brilliant in that second period, and, and brilliant is a big understatement. Uh, Lindbeck was whatever is better than brilliant. Lindbeck was better than brilliant in that game in the second period last night and throughout the contest. Uh, Big win for the Admirals. For Lindbeck, it was his 20th win of the year. He leads the American Hockey League in that category. Huge win for Milwaukee. They've won two straight. They've got good vibes going on into tonight's game. The Admirals are 1-1 one one when facing the Rampage, but for Anders Lindbeck, this will be his first appearance in net. Yeah, the last time the Admirals played them uh, a little bit ago, the, January 12th and 14th in San Antonio, Yusa Saros was with the Admirals and played net, and he was outstanding in both games. Actually, Saros is 8-1 in his career against the uh, San Antonio Rampage, but the Admirals lost the second game three to one on that Sunday afternoon. Uh, that was the first time the Admirals had lost to San Antonio in regulation uh, in San Antonio since 2012. So it was a nice little uh, streak for the Admirals that they had going. Uh, and it also snapped a nine game winning streak of Milwaukee over San Antonio uh, dating back for a couple of seasons. So the Admirals have done historically well against the Rampage, but the Rampage uh, are a pretty good team. Now they're coming off an overtime loss last night at Grand Rapids. Uh, they lost earlier in the week at Rockford. Uh, so they've lost a couple of straight, but and they're on their annual road trip 12 games and 26 days away from home uh, so they're going to be gone for a while uh, Lindbeck will get the call again tonight for the Admirals uh, the Rampage have been rotating goaltenders all season long not sure who they're going to play tonight whether it's Spencer Martin or Vili Husso but both of those guys have done fine and they've both played against Milwaukee Husso is one and one but his goals against is uh, just over one in the two games that he's played against the Admirals so uh, whoever it may be the Admirals need to be prepared to play like they did in the first and the third periods last night in Rockford Puck drop tonight against the Rampage is 7.30. The Admirals start their salute to Nashville weekend where they'll be wearing Nashville Predators-inspired jerseys today and tomorrow. The jerseys are up for auction. We also have our Joan Jett post-game concert tonight, so make sure you stick around for that. If you're an Admirals Rewards member, type in the word Joan Jett to get your 50 po points for watching the game preview. And if you're not making it down, you can always tune in live to 105.7 FM The Fan or watch live on AHLLive.com. For more information about the Admirals, go to MilwaukeeAdmirals.com.